Two minutes away now from physical separation. All Soyuz systems reported in excellent shape to support uh, undocking and landing. The International Space Station now flying 254 statute miles over Mongolia. Inaudible. Okay, the uh, capture is no LED, is no... Uh, no Physical no, separation no. confirmed yeah, at 6.43 p.m. Central Time over northeastern Mongolia. Oh. Indicator LED is off and combined gaso is confirmed. Okay, guys. Good luck. Thank you, Roman. Bye-bye. You remember Kevin's request? Of course. Ford, Novitsky, Tarelkin. Uh, one minute to left. Uh, Departing the uh, facility that has been their home for the past five months. A dark and port is clear, no foreign object. Release transmit. Transmit released. The Soyuz crew reporting that uh, the docking interface at the Poisk module is clean, free of debris. About a minute and a half away from uh, the separation burn that will initiate an opening rate uh, between uh, Soyuz and the International Space Station that will result in uh, the Soyuz moving to a point 12 kilometers away from the International Space Station for its deorbit burn less than two and a half hours from now. About 15 seconds away from the uh, separation burn. This will be a 15 second firing of two of the thrusters on the Soyuz. Depot firing confirmed. 
and the SEP burn is underway. Separation burn being conducted. Uh, depot. And the separation burn complete and good. No longer illuminated, 15 seconds duration. Standing by for ODR via KRL at 0247. Copy close out operations on MCC Go. Down the uh, longitudinal axis of the Russian segment of the International Space Station at the crosshairs, that's the ISS Progress 49 vehicle, which will remain uh, attached to the aft end of the Zvezda service module for about a month. Soyuz Commander Oleg Novitsky with the call sign of Kazbek will now uh, put uh, commands into the onboard computer uh, to uh, initiate uh, the descent mode, basically the load of software on the Soyuz computers that govern uh, descent operations.